Okay, so I'm redoing this video because I didn't have good lighting. Now I went and got a uh, LED light. So now you can see the, uh, the uh, cuts and the actual designs better and clearer, not in the dark, which my first video uh, of this pistol was dark and wasn't properly lit. So uh, here we go. Let's start off with the uh, top. I got a Trijicon RMR. This is a 6MOA. This is the RM07. Uh, the shroud or housing is uh, gray. Um, the barrel is a 3.9 inch Zafiri Precision stainless steel spiraled flush barrel. Let me take the top off. So, there's the spiral. Beautiful. This is the compact model. Um, and then the recoil spring is a 17 pound. Uh, this is Rival Arms. Uh, this is a one piece. Uh, and uh, I didn't see any difference shooting this one and the factory dual captured uh, six sour one. Uh, I don't know the weight on the OEM one. If anybody could drop it in the comments. But I have a uh, dual captured one, but I like the single capture because it's just one piece and uh, it just looks flush to me that's just my personal preference but I didn't feel any like differences or, or anything like that so I kept this one on um, the upper parts kit is a uh, gray ghost precision GGP all these precisions <laughs> Zephyr precision Icarus precision gray ghost precision but uh, the Grey Ghost Precision comes with the firing pin already uh, put together. Um, if you buy from a different manufacturer, you buy in separate pieces. And the firing, you have to put the firing pin pieces together. But Grey Ghost Precision came uh, all put together. And then you just uh, put it in the slide and uh, the safety plunger right here. And the uh, extractor, you just, yeah, you just pop these in the slide and push this down, slide the back plate in, and good to go. So that's pretty much it for the upper parts, right? Zephyr Precision always do a great job on the Cerakote, the cuts, and just everything i mean i've been buying zephyr precision products since like 2016 17 i don't remember it's been so long but i bought a lot of parts for the glock and uh now i'm doing the sigs which uh this is the first sig p320 from zephyr precision that i got um Let's go to the grip module. So this is a Icarus Precision. Wait, let me do that last. Let's do the internals. So the internals is a JSD Supply MUP1, M-U-P, and the number one. Um, it's 80%. I milled it out. Uh, you got to buy the jig separate and the MUP1, uh, this, this piece right here, separate. Put it together, mill it out, and whatever, whatever. Uh, there's a lot of videos on how to do that. But anyway, um, the lower parts kit is from Patmos Arms. Uh, everything internals, the slide lock, AMB slide lock, and all of the uh, housing, trigger housing, and the trigger shoe, flat face trigger shoe. It's all Patmos Arms, except 
the gas pedal. The gas pedal is Go Gun, um, which I swapped out because it just feels so good uh, to rest your thumb right there. You're not supposed to push uh, on it. Uh, you're just, it's, it's a thumb rest, so rest your thumbs. Um, your support hand, you're supposed to hold tight uh, and you're not supposed to push or, or pull or whatever. You're just supposed to support your uh, trigger finger hand, your main hand, uh, and rest your thumb right there on the thumb rest. But uh, a lot of people <laughs> push on it, right? So when they shoot, they're like uh, 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 fighting left, right, left, right. Uh, but that's pretty much Patmos Arms. And, uh, okay, the mag release button is from my other grip module uh, that I'm not using. So I just took that off and installed it in here. And uh, it's just a standard, non, uh, not an extension or, you know, extended version or whatever. Um, and now let's get to the best part, which is this grip module. And once, when I open it, out of the box and uh, unpackaged it, unboxed it, and grabbed it. I was like, wow, this thing feels good. This thing feels solid. And uh, just the undercut right here for your main hand and the support hand uh, undercuts actually is uh, the best I've felt. I did. Glocks myself, and I just can't get it right. But this right here, when you put your uh, support hand right underneath, and then it just sits because you want your hands to be uh, ergonomically like aligned. So when you grip it, they come together and fit. And that's what this grip module does. And then sometimes uh, when I'm shooting fast rapid fire I'll go like this with my index finger and then this has serrations to keep the index finger from slipping and jumping around while rapid fire so that really helped and both of uh, the thumb rest and this front part just helps hold the pistol but this doesn't recoil as much um, because of the heavy uh, body. So that's what uh, I noticed. And then going back and forth with the Glock 19 and the P320 shooting uh, both pistols back to back. Um, this shooting the same ammo too. So uh, this one just the weight of um, this pistol just you didn't feel the recoil. Whoops. Um, yeah, I didn't feel the recoil much, right? Shooting the same ammo. Um, and then the flared magwell. Hate it or love it. I mean, I love the look of it. Pe some people hate it, but I love this. I really do. And then here's the spade. Oh, that just looks beautiful. Um, and the... Icarus Precision logo with the ZP. They're just aligned like beautifully. And, uh, but the Magwell, Flare Magwell, that doesn't help you reload faster. I'm, I'm sorry to tell you, but you got these pro competition shooters or whatever saying, yeah, you get the, uh, I ain't gonna say no names, but we all know the oversized flared Magwells. Yeah, it'll help me reload so much faster uh, and, and shoot faster. Like, okay, whatever you say, buddy. You ain't fooling me. But uh, it, flared magwells are just for aesthetics and looking good, right? Like this one is only from the back end. Uh, oh, this is a 17 round standard compact uh, mag. This one's uh, $49.99, but see it sits flush right here, um, and then the 
21 round mag, which is this one. This is $59.99. This one sticks out. Icarus Precision has a um, a base pad. They have their own base pad, but uh, it's hard to get one. And uh, I've been uh, on the waiting list. So, yeah. But uh, anyways, yeah, that this mag, the 21 round mag, just looks looks good with the little extension because it dips down like this look at that but uh the camo the Cerakote they did an awesome job of course uh, and th these are actually my favorite colors because I actually have these walker and look at this they match and then my sling bag which I carry EDC everyday carry look at this I put cameras in here I got my lenses and stuff I put pistols in here I put a uh, I put my Uzi in here before I didn't like that but uh it just looks good look at the look at the good paint job oh and the beaver tail yeah this feels good it doesn't bite into your uh, hand right here so when you shoot, it kind of like rows instead of jabs, you know. But what kind of gun, what kind of person shoots and it jabs like this. But anyway, uh, yeah, this is the P320 Zafiri slash Icarus Precision Pro Carry March 2022 collaboration. Hope the lighting's better.